The Fort Bend Chamber of Commerce is very active in the economic growth of our county, and that includes business, education, and infrastructure, as a recent breakfast meeting showed. Fort Bend Chamber, we love to host uh, breakfast and lunch events for the residents of Fort Bend County and for those that work in Fort Bend County. Uh, they're great uh, events because it's a typically a small, close-knit group. We know each other, we work with each other, and we care about the infrastructure needs of the county. So they're great events. Um, you don't have to be an engineer to attend. Uh, we all know that infrastructure affects everyone residents, um, when you talk about emergency services, when you talk about businesses, business growth and development, um, we're here for everyone just to learn more about infrastructure in the county. Uh, Stacy is a Fort Bend County engineer and has 27 years of experience in managing infrastructure projects in the Houston area. He has a Bachelor of Science degree in Civil Engineering from Texas A&M University. <laughs> <laughs> and is president of the Texas Association of County Engineers and Road Administrators, a committee member of HTAC Technical Advisory Committee, and HTAC Transportation Improvement Program. So uh, Fort Bend County is going to be uh, requesting that the, that the voters of Fort Bend come out and uh, vote yes for the uh, mobility bond for 2023. Uh, we estimate this bond value to be $400 million and uh, that would cover about uh, 50 to 60 transportation projects throughout the uh, Fort Bend County region. Uh, all of them are ultimate priority projects. Um, there are some areas of the county that, uh, that need transportation improvements immediately, you know, just due to the congestion and the uh, population growth in those areas. Uh, but there's also projects in more undeveloped areas that, uh, that need to be constructed to meet uh, future demands as well. I suggest you just go to the Fort Bend County uh, website. Uh, there's a lot of information on the, uh, the past mobility projects. Uh, just search for Fort Bend County Engineering and look for the interactive GIS map and you can see some of the projects that have been constructed um, in the past uh, 20 years. Uh, there's also, uh, there will be, once we have a 23 mobility program identified, we will post the list of projects for the uh, 23 bond election on that same website as well. If you want more information about our events, please visit thefortbendchamber.com. For Stafford Weekly News, this is Randall Williams.